Jamie, welcome to Baltimore. I'm Rizal, please, you've still got to move over the line. Yeah, I'm buzzing. I mean, um, as soon as the interest come about for me, it was a no-brainer, especially after speaking to the manager. So, yeah, I'm yeah, really happy to be here. Yeah, you left Wickham at the end of last season. How did the move to, to Baltimore come about? Uh, it came about, I got a message from my agent and just said there's a bit of interest down here. Um, and I just went to hear it out. And I'd say once I came down, I met the manager. No-brainer. And how's the summer been for you? It's been good. Um, obviously, it's a, a weird one with everything going on. But I'm just trying to make sure I stay fit and hopefully I can come in here and hit the ground running. Obviously, a fantastic season last season for Wickham. But from your perspective, has it been frustrating to not play the amount of games that you probably wanted to play? Yeah, um, it's been frustrating. But at the end of the day, I mean, the goal was to get promoted. And the boys were playing fantastic. So it was hard to get opportunities at times. But when I did step in, I tried to do the best I could. And hopefully I can come here now and get the minutes I need. Yeah, I was going to say that, I suppose off the back of not playing regularly at Wickham, you want to come here and play regular and be a regular for Bolton Wanderers. Yeah, I mean, it's not going to be a given. I, I have to come here and work, so hopefully I can do what it takes to catch someone in July and keep staying the team. I've been told that you're a, a quick left-sided player. What can you tell us about the type of player you are and, and the attributes that you've got? Yeah, I mean, I'm quick. Uh, I like to get in behind as well, so I think the style here will suit me a lot. You train today. How are you feeling physically at the moment? Have you been working hard in the last month or so to sort of keep your fitness levels up whilst you've not been playing? Yeah, I've been working hard. As soon as the season ended, really, a short break and I've been straight back on it. Obviously, we had a bit of an extended season with the playoffs. So I've come here and I'm, yeah, I, think I feel good. I'm ready to go. The head coach, Ian Everett, has he had a chance to speak to her? And if he's spoken to you, what sort of things has he said? Uh, we've had like quick brief chats and I mean, he just told me about the style of play. Um, and again, that, that really sold it for me. Um, I like how they play. Um, we're going to dominate the ball really so it's all good it's basically a new group of players here you're the fifth team signing of the summer under new management as well of course is it exciting to be part of a, a new look Bolton Wanderers yeah I mean I've only come in recently and it seems like the boys have gelled already and everyone's welcomed me in so I'm really excited to get going obviously the expectations are high going into the new season many people bookmakers included expect Bolton Wanderers to be promoted um, from the league this year. Are you a player that can thrive off those sort of expectations? Yeah, I mean, uh, that's all irrelevant at the end of the day. We've got to go out there and do the job. It's a difficult league. Um, expectations or not, we have to do what we have to do. So you joined in training today. You, you got to meet your new teammates. The new season's now under a couple mm -hmm. of weeks away. How excited are you to get going? No, I'm really excited. I mean, we've got a few friendlies coming up. Hopefully I can get my legs going there and then just go into the season flying.